It is time for the final round of the Masters on the Simulator Golf Tour. We are playing in the Tips Tour today, and we've got to make up nine strokes. We are at eight under par after two rounds. Round one did not go well. Round two, a little better, but we've got a lot of ground to make up. Nine under to tie, 10 under to win at the Tips at Augusta, firm and fast. It's going to be a little dicey. We're just going to hit every shot the best that we can and add it up at the end and see where we are. Let's go play some golf, brother. If I hit it solid, I should be able to fly this bunker. If I don't hit it solid, then I'll either be in the trees or in the bunker. Or you just keep it just left of the bunker. It's got to fade. These fairways are super firm, so I guess that's going to bounce through the fairway. And my guess is correct. That drive leaves us with 111 coming in here, and I'm going to go to a 58, but we're going to have to kind of learn on the fly with how firm these greens are. Kind of blocked it. That might be in trouble. Stay there. Stay there. What is that going to do? Okay, we'll take it. We'll take it. Not that firm of a bounce. I mean, we definitely got a little bit of a bounce and then it still spun, but I was a little nervous that it was just going to do bingo. Kind of like Max Hama's ball in 12 today. That was, ooh, felt for the guy. All right, this thing's going to go this way and then it's going to go this way. So where do we aim? No! Oh, and I'm still putting. Well, that is a shame. That would have been nice to start with a birdie. And now we got a four footer for par. And if you're wondering, we have only a four foot gimme circle on the tips tour. So that means we're gonna have to make some five footer or this four footer and one inch. I mean, come on, just give it to me, would you? All right, got it. No, 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 no. I mean, like this video if that song's also stuck in your head. Hole two, par five time. We got to take advantage of this. We're downhill. I hoping to get a nice high draw way down there and leave us a short iron in. Let's let the hammer feed. Let's feed the hammer. Well, it was a pull fade, but it's going to be just perfect. A little out of the heel, but I'm not going to be picky with where this ball ends up. Run down there. Run. Give me 380. Give me 383. Bastard. We got 192 playing downhill seven yards. I'm gonna go to a nine iron because I think a 175 shot is what we're looking for. Trying to hit it dead straight left of this pin. If it fades on in there and carries that bunker, then we're partying. But I'm not really trying to do that. Oh, you want it to fade a yard and it draws a yard. Sit down. Yeah, greens are definitely a little bit firmer. 15 yard little chip shot we have, and this thing is dead downhill on 13 stimp greens. I wanna give this a chance, so if we have six, seven, five, three, two, eight, six, 12 feet past the hole, we'll take it. I'd like to be past the hole. Give this thing a chance. Just don't miss the green. Oh, and then I leave it short? You gotta be kidding me! What are we doing? I said, get it there. And then I go, ooh, let's get cute with it. Nine back, what am I doing? I'm nine back with a chip for Big Bird and I cozy it down the hill. Four and a half feet for birdie. I don't, you know, if we could stop having four footers, that'd be great, you know? Gimmies are nice. I mean, just Kevin right in the heart we were and we left it short. That is just, whew, get over it, make your four footer. Okay. Thank goodness that went in the hole. We're gonna have to birdie or big bird all the par fives to even have an outside chance. So. Hole three, we've got 345 to the pin. If we hit one hard and we get the right bounce, we can knock it on this green. If we end up going wayward, we'll just deal with that when we go wayward. We didn't go wayward, but I don't think that's got enough to get there. Come on, big hop, and then go left, and then Stay high enough? I mean, why'd you stop there? You were on a great roll. Well, we drove the green, but I'm not very happy because I thought that was really gonna get to like 15 feet. <sighs> 62 feet we have left. How hard do you hit that? I don't know. It's downhill like a foot and a half. I have no idea how hard to hit this. I would love a two putt. I'm not even gonna get frisky because if I get frisky, I might be in that bunker. I don't even know where I'm aiming. Like that looks remotely okay. Maybe a little firm. I have no idea. It's definitely low and it's not firm. 
Okay, my feel is on today. Another five footer, this is fun. Six footer, perfect, even better. So lag pots, let's hit them a little firmer. Chip shots, a little firmer. And play for more break. You know, right edge and hopefully it breaks. We got it, okay. All right, we'll take a birdie on that hole. Birdie, birdie on two and three. Would have been nice to get it on number one, but don't live in the past. Live in the future, hole four. 241. I'm going to a six iron here. I'm trying to play this left. It might go to the back edge of the green, but that's fine. I'm make a three here. We fist pump and we get out. I mean, I hit it solid. That's about what I was exactly trying to do. Now just be soft. Ish. Come down, but it's gonna come down to the left. Great. All right, where does this ball end up? We'll take that all day. We'll take that. This hole is just tough. I don't think I hit it. I don't think I hit it. Oh my goodness. Why aren't these greens 14 on the stem? Got it. Oh, it's hung on on the right side. Good catch hole. Like I said, our three fist pump out of here. Hole number five, playing long and uphill. We cannot carry those bunkers. About 330 and 345, 350 away. Try to hit two good shots and give us a look here. Just gonna go for a pull fade off those bunkers and in the fairway, maybe a little shorter. Just control it, you know? We don't need a bomb here. A heel pull fade, but that'll be just fine. That's way shorter than I would like, but just fine. Should we get a firm bounce? Oh yeah, beautiful bounce. We'll take it. Healed the you know what out of it, but my swing thought when I pulled it back, don't toe snap it. So understandable. 184 slightly downhill, like three feet and a little downwind. I'm gonna go to a nine iron here. Try to hit something around 175, 180 should be fine. Don't wanna go long, don't wanna go left. Oh my goodness, that might be perfect. Might be perfect, sit. Oh my gosh, these greens are firm. Bite, honey. Oh, there she did at the very end. Greens are firm. Greens are real firm. Almost 14 feet we have left. Breaking to our right. I've been debating the line. I have no idea because I don't know how hard I'm gonna hit it. Problems. Let's hopefully get lucky here. Hit it hard. Hit it really hard. Oh, baby. Hammered that thing. My goodness, what was I doing? Whew. I'll take a birdie on that hole all day long, brother. Hole six, we got 191 downhill seven yards, slightly into the wind. I'm gonna go to a nine iron to try to hit it hard so that it could stop. If I hit eight, I think it's just gonna bound through and we're gonna be long. I hit it hard. Uh, it's drawn just a little bit. I have no idea where this is gonna be. Oh, it's gonna be short. Oh my word. Well, that is not what we wanted. That's probably off the front edge of the green. Oh. Or not. Is it gonna stay right there? Stop! Stop it! Right now! Oh, little rascal. All right, after a lot of indecision and arguing with my caddy, who's worthless, I'm gonna putt this ball. We just gotta get it up that slope and then hopefully not off the back of the green, and then I think that's a success. We got it over the hill. It stayed there. Wow, I mean, I that ball got in the air. That ball carried four yards. 18 footer for our par, more than we wanted, but we gotta make this, it's a straight putt. We gotta send it home. Didn't hit it. I did! Oh my goodness! I don't think that should've went in, but we'll take it. Hole seven, playing a lot longer than the pro tees. So we got 440, we're gonna try to hit a pull fade, keep it in the fairway. I seem to not hit this fairway much, so let's try to change that. I think we did it. Did we find the fairway? No, that's off the right side of the fairway. This fairway is just kind of narrow, you know? I mean, land on the fairway, kick off the fairway. Beautiful, love that. 107 uphill seven yards. I'm gonna go to a 58 and just hit it full. Try to land it past it, little bit of spin, hopefully. We'll see. Oh, and then I don't hit it solid, but I did hit it hard. I blocked it out to the right. Where's that? Spin. Didn't spin, great. I got no idea what I'm doing. A little ticklish downhill nine yard chip shot here. Just gonna plop it on the green, let it at least trickle down into the hole or the gimme circle, either are fine. Oh, sit down, honey. All right, we'll take that. I was a little nervous. You know, you catch that just a groove thin, I think we're in the bunker. So 
which off a of mat shouldn't be a worry, but I've done it before. Hole number eight, 585 yard uphill, 20 yards par five. It's gonna take two healthy whacks to get us there. I think we can carry this bunker with the driver, but we gotta hit it solid. We're slightly into the wind. Pin in the back left. I really want us to be on the right side of this fairway to have a line into this green. So I'm gonna try to work a fade, land it just left of the bunker, let it scoot right, theory. Oh, we might have done it. Oh, it's gotta go. It's gotta go. It's gotta go. Go, go. Oh, we did it. I called it just left of the bunker. I wanted it to kick right, but I'm not picky. I got nervous I was gonna go in the bunker. We're not in the bunker. We're very happy campers. All right, we got 242 playing uphill 17 yards. We got a hammer of five iron to get it there, I think. We're gonna try to work it around this tree a little bit. Try to get a little dicey with it. Give us a look at Big Bird. That'd be cool. Oh, and then I healed it. Get through. Oh, it found the gap. What in the world? I got so lucky. We got to putt at Big Bird, but another 50 footer, and we got no idea what we're doing from lag putting. Pretty good speed, I think. Yeah, great speed. Still low. I can't give these enough break if I try. Got a birdie. No Big Birds, but a birdie. And we're four under through eight. I mean, we will take that all day. We're not even gonna talk about the back nine yet. We still got nine to play. Oh, pulled it, but not fading. That might be okay though. Yeah, good thing we hit it hard. Carry the, oh, well. Oh, well, wow. You just didn't really wanna go through those trees. That's fair, after the last break I got out of the trees, I deserved that. Kinda looked like it was gonna carry. 112 playing uphill, eight yards. Very similar to hole seven here, so we're gonna go 58 and hit a 120 shot, and that should be pretty good. Oh, that's gotta go. It's gotta go. Go! Don't spin. Oh, you rascal! I knew you were gonna do that. Stop it right now. Thank you. Oh, I got nervous I was gonna be in the fairway. Now this looks extremely similar to the putt that took me like seven tries in the round of 54. If you haven't seen that video, you're gonna wanna watch that. Took a lot of mulligans on this similar putt, so we practiced it, maybe? That's what we think? Oh, I hit it that hard? I would disagree. I guess I did. All right, I got no feel. Well, I wanted to give it a shot. We did, but now we have this. It's gotta be in. Yes, all right. After the front nine, we are sitting at 12 under for the tournament. Leader still at 17, but I noticed we have a newcomer all of a sudden playing all of his rounds tonight. And he is one stroke ahead of us and he's in his second round right now. So even if we do go low on the back nine, we may not get it, but we're just gonna ignore that and just try to shoot our best score and have a little fun here. And we have arguably my least favorite tee shot on the golf course, hole 10. We gotta crank this thing left to keep it, you know, in play. Flip the hands, see what happens. Flip these hands, baby. <laughs> Missed the tree. Yeah, baby! Ho! Oh, we got lucky on that one. I just flipped it so hard, I pulled it really bad. Oh, but we will take that. We will take that. Trees are 90% air, remember that. We got 124 left in here, probably playing closer to 120. I'm gonna go to a 54 just to try to reduce some spin on the ball and try to hit it 120. 119.4, about as close as we can get. What does that do? Go in the hole, let's go, bite. Well, if I would've known that, I would've hit 58. Did exactly what we wanted to though. Feel pretty good about that. 11 feet down the hills, what we got. It's breaking pretty hard. I think this is enough break, but now that I'm looking at it, probably not. Hit it too hard. Darn it. I don't want to putt again. My goodness, a little less pace and we had it. Urgh, you can't miss 12 footers. Why didn't you guys tell me not to hit it so hard? Okay, hit what I thought was just a beautiful wedge in there. It was, but I thought it would have been gimme circle, not gimme circle. If only we had 12 foot gimmies, 13 foot gimmies, 14 foot gimmies, 40 foot gimmies, we'd be having fun. Cause putting is boring, people. I don't know if you realize this, but me doing this with this thing, no fun. People want to see me hit dog. At least I want to hit dog. This thing, I love this putter, but it's not. I mean, I'll hit driver all day, not putt. I mean, goodness gracious. 
would be nice to keep this in the fairway strictly for the fact that we'll pick up an extra 20, 30 yards. That should be in the right rough. Great. Dang it, we're gonna miss our firm bounce. That is so unfortunate. Get in the fairway. All right, that'll work. Would have loved the fairway bounce there to get us down there, but that's what I get for that. Oh gosh, this is scary. 194, downhill nine yards. We're gonna go to a nine iron. I assume this is gonna bounce and skip forward. Try to hit it 180. Try to not hit it in the water would be the most ideal circumstance. Go for a little pull fade. Gotta fade. She's gotta fade. Hair got in my eyes right in the middle. Man, I should just cut my hair off. That was so stupid. I almost missed that ball. Stay there. Okay, we'll take it. I went back here and just, oh, where's the ball? I don't know, just swing. It's only 11 at Augusta, what could go wrong? Okay, we gotta make this, focus up. That's in, right? No, it's not in! Unbelievable how good of a putt that was. I pushed it point four degrees, and I think that's what costed us. Paulo Costa costed us. Wonder what he's up to today. That is back-to-back -back holes on the back nine where we were this close to going to six, going into amen corner. Now we're in amen corner and we're still praying. We haven't reached amen yet. Well, I'm sure you've been watching coverage of hole 12 all week and they'd say, just aim over the middle bunker. That's the smart shot. That's where the winners hit it. Well, I'm not a winner. So we're going at the flag stick over on the right. I got a pitching wedge. I think it's a 150 to 155 shot. What do we got to lose? Besides a golf ball, but also not really. Oh, I... <laughs> going at the flag, huh? <laughs> no, we aren't. Not if we pull it over there. I'm not mad, but aggravated, yes. Quit on that one. I mean, I got to like right here, and I was like, nope, you're good. <laughs> Left. Left. Keep the shoulders turning. Just like fat guy in a little coat. Fat guy in a little coat. Just turn the shoulders, man. Okay, yes, here we go. Yes, sir. We could use some yes, sir. I know it's not the right hole, but yes, sir. 36 feet, slightly uphill, breaking slightly right. Very makeable. Let's try to make a putt. Can we make putts? Can't make a 12 footer. Maybe we can make this. No! What a great putt. We've gone a little cold, but we got a chance. Hole 13 here, the patrons are getting sleepy. It's time to wake them up. Send a bomb over the corner, give us a wedge in or something. I don't know what we'll have in, maybe short iron, stuff that. Not even have to putt it in the gimme circle. Getting way ahead of ourselves, but that would be cool. Oh, carry! No, get through it. Come on, 90% air. Okay, great bounce, we'll take that bounce. Not that bounce! Oh! Oh! No! We got a great bounce out of the trees and then and then not a good bounce, just kicked right in the water. That is unfortunate, but we still have a chance to make birdie. Drop this ball, knock it tight, knock it in, make a bird. We got 194, playing uphill five, and we got a severe slope to the left. So I got this ball started at Ray's Creek, even right at Ray's Creek, and hopefully it launches left. Gonna hit a seven iron, it's probably gonna go long, but I don't wanna hit eight and just make this hole really stupid. That's gotta be pretty darn good. Come on, honey, soft! And that's not super soft, but, oh, it's just gonna go down. It's not gonna come back. Well, oh, come on, give me more than that. After that great debacle, we have a putt for birdie, but we can't make anything, so probably a par. So we got 22 feet, downhill six inches, breaking hard to the left. It's gonna take a lot of feel, which we have none. So perfect. This putt should be for Big Bird, but it's for four. Trees are 90% air. I mean, what happened back there? I hit it firm, great. Oh my gosh, what a putt. Don't tell me I'm putting for par. What a read. Totally psyched myself out on that. Now I have this for par. Oh baby, thank goodness we made a five. That sucks, been driving it well all day. Catch a tree. Mm. Stay happy, stay happy, we're happy. We're happy, we're playing Augusta, everything's fine. Hole 14, we're gonna need a hot finish to get close to that 17 number. Still sitting at 12, just been iced on 12 all day. Just bomb it down there, brother. 
Well, that's a weak fade, not a bomb, but it'll play. It'll play, it'll be in the rough, guaranteed. Look at that bounce. Get in the rough, what are you waiting for? Just get in the rough. Almost got in the pine straw, my stars, but what an angle we got. It's all about angles. 141 uphill, four yards, so 145, but we wanna hit it probably 140 because I think it's gonna release, bounce, skip, you know, stop, give me a circle, maybe, gap wedge. The patrons are really sleeping, let's wake them up. That should be pretty good, I think, right? Oh no, it didn't get the bounce, out. oh it did, come on! Yeah, we called it. We wanted a gimme. We got a gimme because we can't putt. That deserves some Ric Flair. <gasps> Woo! <gasps> Woo! <gasps> Woo! <gasps> Hole 15 playing 556 from back here. If we can smoke a drive, we can get this ball bounded down there and have a short shot in. We need a big bird or a look at big bird at the minimum here. I'm gonna do something that probably isn't wise. I'm gonna go away from my pull fade because I want the extra yardage. I'm gonna try to hit just a tiny draw down there, get it bounding so that way we got a short iron in or shorter iron in than if we hit a fade. Oh no. No, 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 no. And I leave it out there? What are we doing? I'm blocked out. Just got caught behind it, left it open. I needed that turn. 240, downhill 10 yards. Gotta hit a fade around the tree. We're out of the pine straw. I'm gonna go to a four iron. I was almost at five, but I don't know what the pine straw fully is gonna do to this ball. So I want more, if anything, fade it in there. Hopefully we just carry the water on the green. That'd just be, that'd just be amazing. Yeah, maybe this is stupid. Maybe I should lay up. And I didn't hit it solid. Go! Oh, it might skip. No, it's not gonna. Oh, stay up. Oh my goodness. Oh, I hit it just a fraction heavy and that, that's gonna cost us. That really sucks, dude. Oh, let's just get this up and down for par to keep it respectable. Go, go, go. Oh my gosh, we're gonna make a bogey. Yes! I mean, we needed a three, a four at the worst. We got a five. We deserved a five. We had a horrible drive. We chunked a four iron and I didn't even hit that wedge shot well. We somehow made a putt. Tee shot, man. I should have just hit the fade, hit the fairway, not get too greedy. We would have had a shot. All right, we got 183 playing closer to 185 here. I'm gonna go to an eight iron. I'm gonna try to go right of that flag and use the slope that everybody likes to use. And hopefully it works. Is that gonna use any slope? We have no idea. That should. Maybe, don't stay up there. Don't even joke. Okay, no! Oh my stars! I watch that happen on TV all the time. I'm like, why wouldn't you just use the slope? And here I am, I really tried. I tried to, you know, hit the little fade, you know, right up the middle, land it, slope it. 29 feet downhill, a foot and 10 inches. The fastest putt you can find. We're just gonna tap it. So all we're doing is tapping it in. Just gonna get her going, just tap it in. Tap, tap, tap it in. Right? Maybe? 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 No! That would have been just cool. I mean, we were almost five under through eight, and now we're still five under through 16. Just couldn't get her going on the back nine. Should be perfect. Should have hit the pull fade on 15, you know? Wish we could go back. 120 we have left in, and I should probably hit a 54 and just flight something in there and be cool, but we're gonna be even cooler and try to hit a 58 and throw it back there and rip it back in the hole. Why not? That should be about what I was trying to do. Oh no, the wind didn't, that's, it didn't rip at all? Are you kidding me at 11,000 spin? Oh, I guess it would have to rip uphill. So that makes sense. Okay, I stand corrected. I'd almost be mad if this goes in at this point in around, but we'll take it. Oh, I hit it hard. Down, 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 down. Oh, I don't want to make a bogey. That was stupid. Seven feet, awesome. 
Gotta go in. Yep, all right, gotta park. Well, we're gonna come up a little short. Hole 18 here. Let's just try to put two good swings on this. Finish it out strong. Pull fade, all we need, all we need, all we need. Pull fade, pull fade, pull fade. Perfect. Perfect. Man, if I could putt it as well as I'm driving it right now, things would be looking up. 121 uphill, nine yards, end into the wind. I'm right between a 50 and a 54 here. I'm gonna go 54 and just hit it hard and try to crank a draw and see what happens. Oh, I hit it plenty far. I didn't think I could hit this thing 137, but apparently we can. Spin, hun. No rip! 11,000 spin. Couldn't get more than a, almost plugged. 38 feet to close out our masters down the hill breaking. Can we make it and get the patrons woken up for one more time? Oh, I didn't even hit it. Great goodness. Oh. Well, that is a disappointing finish to a great start of the round. We had all the momentum going, couldn't make any putts, then put two balls in the water on the back nine, on par fives. I mean, pull it out. Urgh! Very upsetting. But with that, we shoot 500 par. We finish in tied fourth at 13 under. And the guy who played his round while we were playing and he ended up shooting 19. So a good thing we didn't shoot 18, think we won and then find out we lose by one. That would have been awful. It was fun. I hope you guys had the most amazing Masters week. It was fun to watch Scotty Scheffler do his thing. Nobody can touch that guy. I mean, that guy is phenomenal. I love watching him swing, freewheeling it, feet flying everywhere. Scotty Scheffler's the man. That'll do it for the Tips Tour Masters. Go check out the shorts to see round one and two. And until I see you in the next video, go play some golf, brother. Bye.